I want to talk a little bit about today about squatting and deadlifting cueing and some of the, uh, at least one of the major technique cues that we've been using recently here at, at Cresty Sports Performance. And, you know, I think as an industry we spent the last, I don't know, five to ten years, probably even more than that, cueing people to excessively over arch their back, which inherently isn't a, a bad thing from a lifting heavy stuff standpoint, but from a long term back health standpoint, not really ideal because just as much as we would think excessive flexion, especially low deflection is bad for the back, excessive hyperextension is going to be just as bad for the back as well. So one of the things we want to, that we cue here at the facility is teaching people to get a little bit more posterior tilt in their, in their back, which is just going to help bring them to neutral, and then we want to squat in that neutral back position. So how we're going to typically coach someone to set up is that setting up arch is fine and to get that tightness is fine. So we're going to get underneath the bar and we're going to be arch. And when we, when we get our air and get set, what we, to, what we like to cue people is to bring their belt buckle to their, to their chin. So I'm going to do that posteriorly tilt, bring the belt buckle to the chin, get in a little bit more neutral back position. I'm going to unload. I'm going to get my air again, tilt, and then we're going to do the squat in that, in that good back position. And we're going to want to try to maintain that neutral spine throughout the set. So we want to, again, coach posterior tilt, we do the belt buckle to the chin, but that's not meaning that we're flexing the spine or that we're going into more flexion. We're just bringing people back to neutral, owning that position, and then squatting in that pattern. And we can do the same thing over here with the deadlift, where before we get down to the bar, instead of telling people to excessively arch their back and stay in that arch position, again, we're going to be here we're going to bring that belt buckle to the chin, posteriorly tilt, own that position, keep the, keep the rib cage down, get down into the, into the proper position, and deadlift in that position. So just to demonstrate that again, we want to start, we're, most people are going to start here, posteriorly tilt a little bit, get down to the bar, bam, and then finish that lift and keep, try to maintain that good back position throughout the whole time. So it takes a little bit of practice. It takes a little bit of practice coaching it, but also actually performing it. But I think in the long run, it's going to help a lot of people, help them perform better and keep their backs a little bit healthier. So give that a try.